we have two, 260,000 students in our public school system. We have a secretary of education who oversees this, and I appointed the fellow. His background is in special education. But the undersecretary of academic affairs for our Department of Education is a former Microsoft executive with a computer science background. So he briefed me a bit about what he's trying to do. We're way behind where Arkansas is now, but I'm going to tell them, I know they have been reaching out to Arizona, but I'm going to tell them to reach out to <laughs> Arkansas because I'm impressed with what you've done. Actually, Puerto Rico is very strong in STEM at the university level. We have several universities teaching computer science, engineering, and so on. So we can you know, do alliances with our universities to try to set this up. I understand that we already have 150 teachers certified to teach computer science. And it's being taught, but kind of haphazardly, because in some regular schools and in some vocational schools, they're teaching it. But it is not mandated. So my first assignment is to make this mandated. Um, I can do it administratively because we have a, one curriculum applying to all these schools, and I will, but it would be better to legislate. So that's one thing that I have to do. Um, and one thing I should say is that even though we are kind of behind, uh, and one thing I didn't say is our kids didn't have computers until, um, you know, uh, laptops and tablets until the end of last year. And teachers got theirs at the end of last year, you know. Now we, and we're trying to improve uh, the access to the internet in rural areas, stuff that all of you face. But one thing that, um, that this fellow, my uh, undersecretary of education is proposing, is interesting, is setting up a P-TECH program, which would be a six-year program allowing students to get a high school degree and then a, an associate degree in computer science uh, because our Department of Education runs some kind of community colleges uh, within the system. So that's interesting. I mean, we, it sounds like they're being ambitious, but we need to start walking before running. So I, <laughs> I will be reaching out and that's, uh, count on that and I, I, I really respect what you're doing.